I have to like start off this vlog with a nice Duramax there. Nice trailer. Looking good. Got a nice baby in the background yelling, crying. Oh, it's a beautiful day. Yesterday was a little windy and very cloudy and cold, but we've all made it here. And if you're wondering why these are here, well, because of the winds, we used it to uh, block the wind because it was just so nasty and windy. The wind would came, first it came from this way, then it came from this way. So we got one trailer here, and there's another trailer that is, you'll see. Oh, he moved. He moved his truck. Okay. So that truck over there was facing this way like this to block the wind coming from this way. And I know you're going to ask me about the solar panels. So this is a little project that I'm doing here. And I know we got generators going and stuff. So once this thing shuts off, I'll, I'll explain it because it's a little loud. But we got a 2000 watt Lion Energy with an expansion pack. We got a Jackery 1000. We got a Jackery 1500 solar panels in there. And we have a generator ready. You know, to me guys, at the end of the day, right now, so far, the king is the generator, the gas power generator. They have not, and I don't know, I'm, I'm still testing this, they have not got up to like par yet or perfect. And I mean, you can see there's clouds and stuff, so when the clouds come, that really kills the power of these things. If they would make these things, or pa solar panels in general, so these are 100 watts a piece. If they would make like one panel, like two or 300 watts, it would make it a lot more efficient because you don't want to have to go and and come out here and stack up panels and panels and panels and panels it'd be you know it'd be easier we don't have to drag a ton of panels if they would make you know and, I, and i'm sure companies are they're starting to do it, but it's not popular yet where you get a panel and one panel you know say it's two or 300 watts because a lot of these things max out at 600 watts so say you set up two panels a piece that were 300 watts boom you plug it in these two panels are easy to move around but these are 100 100 100 i mean i have like 10 panels in there so it's kind of a pain in the butt to sit and take out a ton of panels just set panels and panels and panels and panels up everywhere it's sort of like more work and then you have to hide and then you have to sit and you know i mean you can see the sun's here so what we'd have to do realistically is we got to put them set them right here to get maximum power and then the sun's gonna head that way then we'd have to flip them like how they were. So what I'm doing right now is I'm charging them all up to full. It's a long story actually, but I'm gonna set up more panels and I'll show you guys. This video is uh, it's gonna be about panels and if this stuff works and all that. Um, because right now it's not working all that great, I should say, um, but I'm filling them full. And then don't worry, there will be a desert vlog. It's just, we're out here for like nine days. So I don't wanna, I can't really go up with nine days of desert vlog for you guys, but don't worry, stay tuned. <laughs> well guys we have arrived here at the hill i know this is supposed to be like a solar vlog but i just they all wanted to come right into the hill so decided to go it's not too bad out here in gordon it's pretty busy we got the rammer out here and we got the uh jeep out here and we got smurf papa smurf out here that's what i want to give you one of the one of those like i think it's a hibusa look at this thing look at this thing uh, like a 900 pound whoa 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 wow that's what you need to do go turn in the middle of the hill like that just like he did look at that thing well boy I think we got her stuck a little too hard coming down a hill too that's the worst part so note to self guys if you got one of these shut the damn uh, traction control off 
So what uh, happened was, well, we climbed the hill, but it started like pulling power from me, like on off, on off. And I guess traction control and this thing shuts off only in four low. I was in four high out here going to the hill. Um, so apparently it does not. Thanks. And um, they're real, they're real good help. Really, really great help. So we're gonna get the winch and we're gonna hook up. Uh, it's nothing out here. So, uh, well, stay, stay tuned. What, what do you guys think? Pretty good job. Yes, air down. Um, did it all. It just, I don't, I don't know. It started. It would, it would give me power. Let go. Give me power. Let go. And now we get to drink wine in the freezing cold. Yep. Cheers. Blame, blame me, guys. We have buried the ruby. So cool. It's a great thumbnail. <laughs> right over here. Hey, lock it from free spooling and just let it out. Oh, she can figure it. Just hold this. Hold this. <laughs> hold, the, hold the winch. <laughs> for what's about to happen. This is my first trip at the desert. Eddie's giving me the full experience of getting stuck. Cheers to that. Come out. Nick! I'm gonna scratch my fucking toe down. Don't scratch Go it. Go out! Don't scratch it. <laughs> All right. All right, go. Are you in park with the emergency brake? I'm about to go in there once you get in there. Right. I know. Okay, let's see if the rammer is gonna pull it out. Go! A better thumbnail the jeep or this one on purpose what were you doing how'd you get stuck here you you're me you're recording right now and out of respect i'll let you have it but i don't understand why you're going this route bro i can't see in the day let alone at night yeah we should have, we should say more to the uh, right yeah yeah no, you can't you, you, I, I always thought you were just doing Let's your go. own thing hook me up right here i'll uh oh, you, need <laughs> to be, you need to be facing Let's go back. No, let me uh, just back up real quick. Here you go, Michael. <laughs> hey guys, I'm buried. <laughs> I'm buried. Hey, no, it's okay. I get to repay the. Let's payment. go. Let's do this. This is the same fucking spot that he was buried. No, we need to be more on that side. This guy's taking me to the dunes. Look at this. This is the dunes. That's where you got stuck. Right there. Did he? Remember, remember he was tied. He was tied up on that boat. Can we take this through? No, I, I have a strap with me. No, my snatch Wait. block is in my truck. Can we think, think this through? You think it through? I'm going to get a thumbnail real quick. A little more.
Because I can't pull. There's no way I'd be able to pull you. You fucking bury the deep. Everybody has officially arrived. The camp's a little weird though. You know, we've got people here. We've got just, there's, I think there's just too many people. And because of the wind, we had to bring a trailer in because it was way too windy. Then we got Chef Mike over here. What do we, what, 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 come, come on, come on, come on. Let me, you know, let me have it. You want to see it? Let, sure me, you see let it? me see it. Wow. Oh man, all right, I came too early, guys. It came too early. We're gonna have to no, wait a little bit. Post, what you should have gotten with last night's dinner. I know. I actually, actually completely forgot the vlog. Yeah, we'll wait. The well, something's gonna, gonna go in there. Out. And yeah, and the alkylators just arrived over there. So uh, all the all the chefs and are. Always got to make sure that we're just missing Big Lou. Yeah, yeah, Big Lou. Yeah, he's not here. But all the sh all the majority of the chefs uh, have arrived. We got the outside heaters in case it gets cold. It is cold, and it's a little windy. You can see the flag, so we brought the trailer to block block and everything, and the alkylator. He's feeling a little down, so he's not allowed to touch our food or cook. We stay away from the operator. Oh, geez. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, gosh. Well, guys, now it's drag time over here. That's a nice Duramax over there. Look at it right over there. Look at this dirty Max. He's going to go down the drag. Look at that old cat eye right there, boys. That's a good looking dirty Max. All right, here we go, boys. Looks like a Raptor versus Duramax. Oh, yeah, he just spanked that Raptor. Oh, he just spanked him. Yeah, he left a nice little cloud for everybody. All right, let's do the rematch. Man, he just spanked him. vlog i didn't vlog too much um just because just want to hang out with the fam you know and uh, just enjoy the desert but i had to do some vlog the original vlog was supposed to be actually about these solar panels you guys see i've been i've got tons of generators here honda 7000 pure crap and uh, it was supposed to be originally about you know this thing uh i'm not doing it yet because i found some flaws on this Hopefully um, they've they've got back to me and they fixed them and then I will let you know But another thing a lot of you guys tell me is Eddie. I noticed you You must drive this thing in the stock tune a lot and I do believe it or not guys this thing stays in the stock tune and This is gonna answer some of your guys questions where you said Eddie well <clears throat> I try to tow an eco and I tow and tow and I feel like the stocks got more power it does. That's why I tow the stock tune, guys. So Eco is not made for towing. Uh, it's not made to give you power, you know. Now, the and, and this is, I'm talking about for the tunes that I have. So if you guys have the tuning that I have, this only applies to you guys and only applies to a 3500, maybe, because I don't know if a 2500 it makes a difference or not, which I'm sure it does uh, because it's the same tuning company. But Eco is not made for to for towing. I would never tow in the Eco tune. Now, a lot of you guys say, "Well, then why wouldn't you just tow in the tow tune?" So you guys try it. Me, the way the tow tune is set up is it 
I feel like it gives you torque everywhere. Not saying the tuning company, the way they designed the toe tune is not like, not perfect, but I personally, I mean, you guys can try the toe tune, but I like stage one, the stock tune. Now, some of you guys say, oh, I don't like the hiss. Well, when you're driving, you don't hear it. And then also, uh, for some of you guys, because this is what I do, if you notice when you're on the stage one, and try it. If you guys got my tunes, put it in the stage one, just drive it in the stage one and try it. You're gonna be like, whoa, this is crazy. Um, if you don't, you know, like it uh, hissing, then you can, uh, you know, contact Raj and he'll change it for you, or the tuner, they'll change it for you. Um, but uh, me, I, I don't really care once I'm driving what, you know, the hiss is. I mean, you can switch it on the fly. So what I do though, uh, do though is, once I get to my destination, once the truck is done, I will switch it into number two to open uh, the veins in the turbo to allow the exhaust, the heat, to escape faster. If you guys notice, when it's in one, the veins are 85 or 89 percent. Uh, watch the EGTs. The EGTs will like sit there and will not cool down. Hit it to two, watch the EGTs go to five percent, and all of a sudden watch how fast the EGTs and how fast the truck cools down. So that's just a little tip for you guys. And uh, for you complaining, oh, it doesn't tow good in eco. I wouldn't tow in eco, guys. I would drive, if you're trying to save fuel mileage. Uh, I, I'm, I don't care for the fuel mileage. I did, I'm not interested in fuel mileage. I'm not trying to save fuel mileage. So that's why I drive always in these stock tunes. So uh, if you guys have 3,500 and have my tunes, give it a shot. And when I say my tunes, I don't run Matt's tuning, guys. Optimal Welding tunes, I stopped running him probably a year ago, almost a year ago. I don't run Matt's tunes anymore. Um, I will not run Matt's tunes anymore, so it's, I don't run Optimal, optimal Welding's tunes at all anymore. So uh, just to clear up uh, that for you guys. But that's all I got for you guys today. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys liked this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Don't forget to click subscribe. Peace. Yeah.